guys! So today is officially June the 2nd and y'all don't know this but it's my birthday month. Tomorrow I will turn 22. Taylor Swift here. Hey. So last minute I decided, I told my family, I said we're going somewhere because 21's everyone's year. You know you're you're legal. You can do more things that you could you couldn't do at 20. But now that I'm 22 that's not really that cool anymore so I'm like how can I celebrate to make me forget that I'm 22 and growing up? So I told them, I said, can we go to New Orleans for the weekend? And they were like, okay, let's go. So that's what we're doing. So I made a little schedule of what I wanted to do. And yes, I sound like a little kid when I say this, but my biggest thing I wanted to do was go to the zoo because I haven't went to a zoo in years. And animals are adorable. They are literally adorable. And they're just... Nobody goes to see them and they're in cages and I'm just like, I want to go see them. So we're going to see some animals and that's not the only thing we're doing, but we're going to the French Quarter. We're going to do just, you know, your basic New Orleans tourist thing. We're going to stay the weekend and I'm going to take you along with me and you're going to get to spend my birthday with me and we're going to celebrate me. We're going to act like this video just shuts off right here and the next thing you're going to see is me tomorrow. See you then. <laughs> it's my birthday. So I just woke up and I'm officially 22. <laughs> like I haven't moved. I even I still have my kitty down here with me. I sleep with her every night. <laughs> 22, but never too old for you. What's up, this hair? <laughs> wow. <laughs> I'm going back to sleep. I'm old and tired now. <laughs> Day two, literally going to get breakfast just like this. Oh my gosh, <laughs> look at this. Yeah, I had a good birthday, but now it's the next day and we get to go to the zoo. We get to go to the French Quarter again. And yeah, the next time you see me, hopefully I won't look so bad. This is ridiculous. Thing's looking at me. Uh-uh. No, no, no. No, no, no. Oh. 
This says it's supposed to be a snake. Oh, and look. One over here is waiting for something. So it's been like two days since the trip and I'm finally making a outro video. I didn't make anything to end it off with as usual. I always forget. Anyways, a little recap of the video and the trip. On the last day, I went by Ulta. I had a little gift card that my boyfriend gave me. So I got me some little happies, of course. And I redeemed my Ulta birthday gift. And when I got to the counter, they didn't have it. It was out of stock. Just my look. But the girl at the counter was so nice and she literally was like, I got you. She just starts throwing samples all in my bag. Like she gave me like five samples. I was like, whoa now, like what else do you have back there? Can you just keep throwing those in? But so I wanted to give you a little haul of what I got in New Orleans and what I got at Ulta. I didn't really get anything in New Orleans because I go there a lot because I'm from Mississippi. So we live like right next to it. And I actually got a souvenir shirt. So I thought it was really cute. I'm gonna show you. So I was at, I don't know where I got it. I have no clue, but I was at a little shop on bourbon and it says the big easy New Orleans. And it's like green. You can't really tell in this video, but it's green. And I got it because of this. <laughs> I'm so bad at YouTube videos. It's got a cable car on it and I love cable cars because I just got to ride one for my first time in San Francisco and now I'm obsessed. So, little, or trolley, whatever you want to call it, it's, it's basically the same thing. It's so cute. I love this shirt. I'm gonna wear it like everywhere. Okay, so to the next thing. Let's go through my Ulta haul now. First of all, let's go through the things I actually bought and then I'll show you the things that she threw in my bag. First of all, I bought this. This is the, uh, this is hard. Y'all make it look so easy on here. This is the Ordinary Buffet, I think. It's a little serum. This is so hard, y'all. How do y'all do this stuff? Shout out to my beauty bloggers. On okay, yeah, so. Ordinary Buffet Serum. It's just really good for the skin. You put it on AM and PM and it makes you pretty. It tightens your pores, uh, helps with fine lines and all the good stuff that you need at 22 because now I'm old. Next thing, I got this Milani Glow Foundation. It is actually a hydrating skin tint. 
So yeah, it's not really a foundation, but it's your skin tints. Basically makes you glow and not look like you're wearing makeup. And I'm actually wearing it right now. This has been on my skin all day and I was at work today. So yeah, I look a little bit oily because I have like combination skin, but yeah, Milani is the bomb. You should totally try this. This is not sponsored. <laughs> I feel so lame. I've never done this kind of stuff, so. But it should be. So, Milani, if you're watching this, I'm wearing your foundation, and I think it's awesome. Wink, wink. Okay, next thing. Oh, this is my favorite. So, do y'all know this brand for hair? I think you, it's called Quay. I, I don't know how you say it. I have no clue. But did you know that they have a perfume? I didn't, I just found out about it and I've tried their dry shampoo and it smells amazing. So I was like, oh my gosh, they have a perfume. So I didn't get the full size because your girl's broke, but it wasn't that expensive. I got the travel size and it was like $22 and it came in this little tube thing. The actual perfume looks like this. It's very cute. Uh, I'm so bad at this. It's, it's huge, like for $22, like it's basically the size of my hand or part of my hand, I don't know. But it's gonna last me forever. And when I tell you it smells like just a nice clean, I don't even know if it smells like flowers. I just feel like it smells like clean hair. Just clean, refreshing, sophisticated and chic. That's what I would call this. This is the cutest little thing and you need it for your purse because it's gonna go with me everywhere now. Okay, that was the last of what I actually bought. So let's get on to the samples. So she gave me this. It's Green Apple Juice Beauty Brightening Emulsion. E emulsion, I think that's how you say it. Basically, it's some face cream and you put it on your face at night or I guess you could do it in the daytime, but it's got vitamin C in it. So you kind of have to be cautious so you don't hurt your skin. And it doesn't have a smell because I actually smelled of it because I figured if this smells like green apple, it could be good or it could be bad because it could irritate my skin, but it didn't. So it was amazing. I think it's just got like things that are in a green apple in it, like ingredients. So that's probably why they named it that, but Anyways, thanks Ulta. Second thing is Mario Badescu. I, I don't know how to say these words, but, and this is why I'm not a beauty influencer. You just gave me the one with the aloe and coconut water. And yeah, this is gonna be perfect for summer. So happy me. You gave me this. I have never seen this brand before, but it is a uh, hyaluronic cloud hydrating body cream and it is by peter thomas roth thomas roth i don't know how you say that but yeah we love hyaluronic acid because you know i'm getting old by the minute so i need all the hydration i can get so i love it that's actually it so Thank you Ulta for all the cute little samples for my birthday. I hope you enjoyed my video and yeah, I'm 22 now and I can't wait to see what this year holds for me. So I will see you later and don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, whatever you want to do. I don't really know how these things work, but yeah, see you later.